name's Catherine Wren. I'm a viola player and in 2016 I founded Nordic Viola which um, yeah, is basically a project um, based around a small ensemble of players um, focusing on the cultures and the music of the North Atlantic and sharing stories with the communities there um, and trying to connect people across, across the North Sea and the North Atlantic region. Nordic Viola came out of my sabbatical year in 2016-2017. I travelled around um, between um, Shetland, the Faroe Islands, Iceland and Greenland, uh, meeting other musicians, uh, learning a bit about the cultures, learning a bit about the music um, and putting that into my, my own words I suppose and um, exploring those stories and it's grown and developed from there. I didn't really expect it to last this long but um, it's getting bigger and bigger. I love working with people and being able to share those stories and also um, as an artist um, I guess I find inspiration working with other artists and le learn a lot from looking at how other art forms approach a subject and I find that cross fertilizes my work so I think about my music in a different way um, and approach creating in a different way. I think the, the biggest benefit I've, I've had from collaborating with other artists um, is looking at, at new ways of making music. I've really enjoyed working with Orla on um, looking at, at painting those scenes and, and, and it's fascinating how Orla's interpreted the music and put that into a visual form, uh, which inspires me to work the other way around now as well, to want to create music from the art um, and, and also to work together and, and create something new from that and uh, look at the light and the inspiring landscapes and, and put that into sound, I think. I think my, my dream project is bringing together all the art forms that I'm interested in, so music, words um, and art. Um, I'd love to travel them, to take them around the, the whole of the region that I've worked in, definitely to the Faroe Islands and to Iceland, and if we could get the funding to take it on to Greenland, which I think for Orla especially would be such a different landscape and such an inspiring place to be, um, and I think that would spark a whole new, new field of work can bring artists from those regions into our project as well. I think being out in the landscapes is my happy place, is, is the most important thing and I want to express that through my art and to try and inspire other people both to visit those landscapes and also to connect the landscape and the music. So, so much art um, is, is created in urban spaces, um, which isn't the, the place that I relate to. Um, so I'm really passionate about bringing art out into rural areas and making it more relevant to those areas. Um, I love just sitting and listening. It's something I learned to do on sabbatical, to just sit on my own for, for hours sometimes and just listen to what was around me. And the more you listen, the more you the more you here um, and again for people who maybe find that harder to then translate that into a visual aspect um, and sometimes the only music you need is is what you're hearing in the landscape just standing here and listening to the sound of the waves behind us and the wind um, is, a, is a really beautiful thing and it's whether you use it as real sound or whether you try and mimic that but there's so many possibilities with that I think.